installing the Windows 10 anniversary update. Hi everyone, Leo Notenboom here. I just want to show you quickly how to install the Windows 10 anniversary update. Go to this URL, I've got a short link for you, goaskleo.com W10AU. That page has a download link that will actually download a small program that will do the work of getting and installing the anniversary update appropriate for your machine. Click on that, run it. So you say yes to the uh, UAC prompt, of course. Once this utility is running, uh, it's obviously going to let you update to the latest version of Windows 10. Say update now. Now, while this is happening, I'm gonna go ahead and close Internet Explorer because we just don't need it anymore. It's gonna take a couple of minutes to basically check compatibility. Of course, this machine is already running Windows 10, so it should be completely compatible, and it is. We'll hit Next. And now it's going to get the update ready. Now, this is a very lengthy process, so I'm actually going to speed things up by a factor of 50 so you don't have to wait for the half an hour or hour or however long it took for this to happen for me. It's actually downloading the update, updating Windows, rebooting a time or two or three, Your PC will restart several times, it says, and it's not kidding. I think that was the fourth or fifth reboot at this point. I'm actually going to go ahead and use Express Settings, even though I generally don't recommend it. I'm going to be using this particular machine as an example machine for essentially changing those settings when you don't have that opportunity, when you, when you uh, ended up with the Express Settings. And that's it. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and log in here and we'll see that we now are back in Windows 10. Now running the anniversary update. There's one thing I'm going to do here and that's because it did change my screen resolution on me. I usually run 1600 by 900. So I now need to go back and change my screen resolution back to that, uh, that resolution. And we're done. I go ahead and keep the changes. That's essentially it. This is Windows 10 anniversary update. You'll notice it doesn't look a whole lot different. The easiest way to tell what you're running is to look at the start menu and you'll see that the all programs list is included as well as the, a few controls there off to the left. As always, if you're watching this anywhere but on AskLeo.com, here's a link to this video on AskLeo.com. That's where we read and moderate all the comments. I look forward to hearing what you have to say about your experience with the anniversary update. Remember, stay safe, have fun, and of course, don't forget to back up. Take care, everyone.